Members of the National Association of Nigerian Students have picked uh, South Africa's business interests over xenophobic attacks on Nigerian living and studying in South Africa, which has led to the death of many Nigerians in that country. Some of the business interests picketed, including MTN office and Stambik IBTC along Ukelewo area of the state capital. Now, leading members of the association in Abel Kuta, the state capital, the National Public Relations Officer Adeye Miyazis said it is imperative in order to send the right signal to the South African government. If at this point in time we fail to speak, history will never forgive us, neither posterity judge us well. It is no longer news that Nigerians in South Africa are being killed, maimed, and robbed of their belongings daily. Our federal government, our government at the federal, have refused to talk. You will agree with me that if not for the struggles of Nigerian students, the democracy we are all enjoying today will not be alive. Yes. If you can fight continuously for the survival of democracy, we we'll see no reason for us to rise to defend our brothers in diaspora. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Nigerian students cannot continue to pretend as if things are going well. Yes. Oh. Today, we have continued on our continuous struggle to show the South African government that we are ready for this battle. Mm -hmm. Nigerian students have resolved to go by the way of the third law of motion. For every action, yes. there is a resultant reaction. Mm -hmm. But this one will not be a direct resultant. Mm -hmm. Kill a Nigerian will kill three South Africans here. Destroy a Nigerian business here will destroy three South African businesses here. Oh, Today we have maxed out to lock down, shut down all South African business interests here. Yes, South African businesses are coming here and be thriving well, making deposits of millions to their country over there and be killing our own citizens over there. Mm -hmm. We have resolved and we have decided that this is the beginning of the titanic struggle that will consume South Africa in Nigeria as well. Nigerian students will not pretend, as I said earlier, will not for any reason pretend and watch our brothers over there being killed. The fact remains that the power of anarchism and anarchism lies out of Nigerian students as such. We have resolved to kill South Africans once we receive news of Nigerians being killed over there. And Luther continue. Amen.